Hi there, I'm doing another video on how to refresh curly hair. Um, basically, this one's a little different because this video I'm not using curl cream. If you're more of a softer, wavy haired person, or if you've already used curl cream or you're doing your second day hair, you don't want maybe you don't want as um, heavy of a product on your hair like curl cream's too heavy so and it weighs your curl down or like I use curl cream on my hair last night and this is my second day hair and so I want something lighter and I went to work I was at work all day so I had my hair in a low ponytail and you can see like a little bit of an indention and you can see that my hair is not that frizzy um, that's because I do the curly girl method and my hair is really moisturized now so I don't have that much frizz and I have well-defined curls more than I did before when I didn't do the curly girl method because you guys are probably thinking well every time she refreshes her hair her hair already looks good well <laughs> it just looks better than before because I'm using better stuff on my hair so I'm going to show you for you people that don't want a bunch of product in your hair or weaker waves. So um, what I do is I put, if you're a more curly girl, you can use a heavier um, silicon free conditioner. And if you're lighter, uh, if you have a softer wave, you can use a lighter conditioner like Suave Naturals. Um, but this one is like a one that's in between. Um, this one's like the best versatile co-wash leave-in conditioner because it's in the middle. So you could do co-washing, you could do leave-in, you could, you know, do a bunch of different things with it. But anyways, I'll get to it. So what I do, instead of co-cream, I use this. And I just um, put it in my hair. And I do the same thing I did yesterday. Uh, my hair doesn't frizz as much as it did. I just scrunch um, before I did the curly girl method because all frizz is is just a curl waiting to happen and it's reaching up to the air it's dry so it's reaching up to the air for moisture and so that's what creates frizz it goes up so if I want to get rid of frizz and help my curls stay together and clump I have to give it moisture so this one is moisturizing enough to help my curls um, not frizz as bad but it's not gonna weigh me down and um, yeah so then I just put it in and then I scratch and um, you can put a little more um, back here if you want I mean I don't do this all the time it's just, like I said, I do this, like, in the evening or just, I don't know, if I'm going somewhere or, like, just whenever I want. The more you, and longer you do the curly girl method, the um, less you have to moisturize because your hair is getting healthier and more moisturized. So, it does look a little bit wet right now because I put conditioner in it, but, um... I'm gonna let it dry and then I'll come back and show you guys what it looks like dry okay now my hair is pretty much dry um, I just dried it like I don't know, five to ten minutes I mean I didn't dry it I just dried it as I was sitting here and um, doing my makeup and I changed and so um, again like before in my other video I just scratch and then um, then I just put my hands underneath my hair like that and uh, shake it like that and um, yeah it gives me more volume and um, yeah um, see it perked up my curls down there big time so yeah I just do this like in the morning if I'm training at second day hair um, 
or like when I get off work or just whenever I think it needs it. I mean, I don't do it all the time, just like, you know, whenever. All right, try it.